This is Harvester of Sorrow by Metallica off the end Justice for All album. It's standard tune, and you're going to start out on the G note, palm muted, go to the F sharp, to an open E six string palm muted, to a B, B flat palm muted, A fifth string open palm muted, back to the G, back to the F sharp, then the E. It's going to sound like this. Okay. Then it's going to be clean tone. You're going to hold like an E chord. E open, the sixth string open, fifth string, second fret, fourth string, third fret to second fret. Okay, back to those notes again. Instead, you're going to go to the fourth string, fifth fret, to the fourth string, third fret, to the fourth string, second fret. Then you're going to hit the fourth string open after you do that. Fourth string open. Okay, then it's going to be sixth string, third fret, fifth string, second fret, to a fourth string open. Then it's going to go to a sixth string, first fret, and then fifth and fourth string open. Or a fourth string open. Okay, so what I just showed you just there, um, add some distortion and do the same thing, but kind of listen for the palm mutes in the open chords. Then you're going to slide from the G to the, to the F sharp to the, let's see, that would be B to B flat, back to the G to the F sharp. Or to the F. Then you're going to hit the 6th string open, palm muted, the 6th string 1st fret, hammer on to the 6th string 2nd fret, and then it's going to be 5th string open, okay, 6th string 2nd fret, to the 1st fret, palm muted, then, then open E, open 6th string. going to be just like before, 6th string open, palm muted, to the 6th string 1st fret, hammer on to the 2nd fret, then you're going to go to the 5th string 1st fret, and back to that 6th string 2nd fret to 1st to fret to open. Okay, then it's going to go uh, kind of like that riff again, 6th uh, string palm muted to a 6th string 1st fret, hammer on to the 2nd fret, then go to the 5th string 1st fret, 6th 
6th string open palm muted. Do an e, uh, e. Same six string palm muted open to a palm muted six string first fret. Hammer on to the second. Then you're going to go up to the fifth string fifth fret. Palm mute the G. Okay, so the tail end is going to sound like this. Riff is going to be palm muted E, six string open, palm muted. Okay, then you're going to go up to the second fret, six string. Okay, then you're going to hammer on and pull off the third fret to the second fret on the six string, okay? Go to the E. that same thing, but instead of going to the E on the tail end, you're going to go to the G. Now that interlude is going to be, it's going to be palm muted, six string open, twice. Okay, then you're, then you're going to hit it again, but you're not going to palm mute it. Okay, then you're going to hammer on and pull off the fifth string, second fret to open. And you're going to go fifth string, third fret, fifth string, fifth fret, to a fourth string second fret okay then on the third on the fourth string third fret you're gonna palm mute it strike it twice to a third fourth string fifth fret third string second fret to third fret On that second tail end is going to be third string, second fret, to a fourth string, third fret. And you're going to go to the F. Okay, then it's going to go to the third string, third fret, pull off to the second, and then open. Same string. Okay, then it's going to be third string, second fret to third fret. Back to the second fret, then open. And then you're going to pull off the fourth string, third fret to second fret, then open. Okay. Then the next one's going to be a, just like that first part, but then you're going to go to the fifth, fifth fret, third string. Okay, and then you're just, and then you're going to pull off the third string, third fret to second fret, then open. Then you're going to go to the F. Have fun with it.